Photoshop tutorials for beginners. How to repair old photographs by using Adobe Photoshop. Now this is an introduction to a free 179 page book called Getting Started with Photoshop. This type of uh, editing task can be carried out in any CS version of Photoshop and these Adobe Photoshop lessons can be applied to the edition that you have got installed on your computer. So just sit back and listen with your Photoshop software opened up. Old pictures are often regarded as priceless. They serve as great solutions to protect memories that possess great emotional value. Sadly, the same as with anything else which is old, they have the likelihood of wearing out as time passes. Colours may not be as vivid as before because of fading. Tears may be visible after years of being handled. But luckily Photoshop offers, offers lots of resources that will be very easily assist you recover such treasured moments. Getting photos restored using a professional costs a lot of money and you've got to take into account the simple fact that you're not really sure about the level of quality that you're going to receive. Thankfully though, along with a bit of work, you can use Adobe Photoshop to revive the photos yourself. For those who have access to a scanner, all you have to do is scan the pictures into the laptop or your computer so that you can start the restoration procedure. I will now outline some methods you can use to fix your photographs. The initial step for editing old pictures is by simply transforming it into a digital file format. To do this you have to scan the photo and save it on your PC. Then the next phase is to open up the photo within Photoshop. Once you've stored it you may use your built-in tools accessible in Photoshop to begin modifying it. Once more be certain that you're modifying a copy of your scanned photograph, never the original just in case any mistakes are made. The actual smudge tool is but one of the very most useful tools for repairing pictures. You may use your smudge tool to repair any tears in the photograph. The smudge tool also can eliminate any blemishes too, including humidity, staining and sun exposure. Another common problem with photos is usually lighting issues. By using the brightness and contrast panel, you can easily adjust the lighting and leave a much more sharp, clearer version of your original. There are a number of other resources which have been incorporated into the software that will help you improve and repair your photos. Hopefully you've seen just how easy it is to truly restore a photo with Photoshop. The tools I pointed out are only a small section of what's offered to make your ordinary photos look quite amazing. In fact, after a bit of practice you'll be able to change your black and white pictures into colour by just applying a few of the readily available tools found in Photoshop. All it takes is a bit of practice and in no time at all all of your friends will be asking you to fix their old pics. So to grab your free 179 page report on how to get started with Photoshop make sure you click the link below the arrow. Or just visit www.learnphotoshopnow.com forward slash blog forward slash free dash book. Thanks very much.